because I feel like the Discord has been ripping pretty hard for for space looters. Like, what did you or what did you expect? Or like, did you think what is there like four or five hundred people in there right now? I thought that was pretty pretty good in terms of like people that you know. It's nice to have an artist like Josh, you know, a little cool that's like already has like you know some IRL cred, you know. So it's like not as hard as like becoming this like anonymous new nft creator you know Mm -hmm. well we want to focus on organic growth so i've been ecstatic with how it's been going thank you for the to the fwb fan and everybody else who's been spreading the word we really after working on a couple projects i've learned that it's best to attract the ideal collector so we've been really like uh hounding on like the you know the quality of people we bring in there but you're absolutely right like it's such a pleasure to be able to work with an artist of josh's caliber because his you know not only does his artistic portfolio kind of speak for itself but so does his collaborative portfolio uh from like he's collaborated with brands like bathe Nate, nike converse warby parker like you mentioned absolute vodka apple and more and he's just like a really humble guy too because <laughs> i knew him uh before before we worked together i knew him pretty well but like since you know promoting this stuff i'm like wow this guy's like everywhere he's done everything he kind of like downplays himself a little bit um uh that's how, yeah that's how i feel yeah <laughs> yeah it's awesome it's awesome and like the fashion too is is nuts like on his site um i'm wearing like a little cool hoodie right now and it's just like it's just so fresh i want the pants i want the pants in the in the beanie i think or not the beanie but like the bucket hat Mm -hmm. Um, and he has experience with it all like he has experience ordering you know fabric and like he as an artist he can oil paint he does color pencils he does illustration like there's nothing that i feel like he doesn't do um so i'm I'm like it's been awesome working with him and also just as a marketer for like other projects the data doesn't lie either like these are highly engaging pieces um it's it's just crazy it's crazy too because like you know i knew josh like just through living in new york and like so many of my friends that have like stuck it out, like, cause I, I tapped out at like 10 years and Josh is probably running on, he's probably rolling into 20 years. And it, you know, there, it was just such a, it's such an understatement to like, to say, you know, about how, like, you know, being, being at the, like the, uh, the finger of the pulse, if you will, like about all this shit. And it's like everything, everybody was like trying to make their shit happen there. Like, doesn't matter how big a company, you know, I remember when like a J crew flagship popped up like by my house or something like that in 2012. And that seemed crazy, but like now going back there to that same area, it's like, you know, insane high rises and just like, just never stopped pumping there. And it was, it's just like the opportunities people had and, and just the, 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 the street cred kind of that Josh has, it's like, obviously it's nice to, that's what brands want, you know? And that, that's always the hardest part of being the artist. It's like, oh, I'm not going to do Warby Parker because I'm, like, cooler than that. But it's like, you got to fucking take a check every once in a while and just move on, you know what I mean? It's like, you can't be, like, fake homeless forever, you know? Yeah, yeah. And he's he really has, like... And that's what I love about working with him, too, because not only does he have... A long career behind him but you can tell he has a long career ahead of him which is like also just perfect for the nft space 